Welcome back to Bi-Weekly Bills. I have a very special bill for you today, an outpost, so I hope you take the time to bill along or grab a hot drink and relax with us. Hello and welcome back to Bi-Weekly Building. Um, this video is currently two weeks old, as you're seeing it, recorded it two weeks ago. Um, and I was hoping to use some more 1.20 stuff in this build, but no, unfortunately, um, I just didn't have enough time to experiment and play around with, uh, with the stuff and, uh, unfortunately couldn't get anything, um, worked in, but hopefully the next build should, uh, should have some stuff so that would be uh, that would be good but what we're we building we are building a little outpost um, in a birch forest which is quite a nice location um, you'll notice it's quite dark it's you know in the shade because I forgot to slash set time yeah I forgot to set the time to noon so yeah the video is in the shade um oh well uh but we have uh, again done sort of what i did with the last build where i'm blocking out sort of what i'm doing um you can see there i changed from the stairs to full block uh, that was to aid with texturing actually um which worked quite well um, I think texture then detail so um, having the texture already there it basically just told me what block to put there um, what's there to replace it with so that's pretty good um, but yeah uh, basically I designed this sort of build uh, in my creative world um, or roughly I got an idea and then built it in this world um, and I basically I improvised those walls um, I mean, they're not too difficult right I mean they're, they're just walls so uh, yeah um, there's a couple other buildings uh, like this one um, which is I don't know just sort of like a little guards hut um, I didn't really sort of think too hard about what these buildings were just that there were buildings um, which is a bit different to how I usually build I usually try and sort of give a building a purpose because then it you know it generally then feels like it's supposed to be part of the world you know if, if you can come up with a reason as to why it exists it will probably make sense um, you know so I built a stable you know there's probably a lot of people coming through on horses you know whoever's guarding this place probably also has horses so they need a place to store that um, or them uh, but yeah those two sort of outer buildings they could probably be used as like a mess or a bit small though um, or some like guards quarters or something um, but now we're moving on to the the big towers uh, the two big white towers they uh, they look quite good actually um, and I'm just giving them like a little little wooden sort of roof thingy um, you see these on castles occasionally we sort of like a slight slope on the roof uh, beyond the battlements but now we're getting into the texturing uh, so I think I did the stone first with some cobblestone some andesite you know, so yeah, typical stuff uh, I didn't feel like it did these little walls too well so um, I, uh, I just went through manually did a little bit of detailing um, and there we go there's me changing the stairs um, to some better 
better stairs oh, better clipping through the tree um and yeah that was actually quite useful using weld edit to texture and then just replacing um the sort of blocks that's quite useful actually um but yeah this build wasn't too difficult um you know i mean it's basically just a couple squares with some rectangles attached to them um the most difficult thing actually i think was the texturing of these two towers because they're very flat um and um i also wanted to use diorite like i did on the uh, the last build but it just there was something about it just didn't work well um i i don't know what really it was i i think it was maybe being a bit too sort of detailed a bit too grimy and stuff um, he says that but the next thing that we texture literally has dirt blocks in it which is a very noisy texture which is obviously very good for getting dirty textures um but i added some sort of windows or arrow slits or something so that's what those are um uh, as i said yeah texturing the mud buildings it's i mean it's all right to texture packed mud um it's obviously a really really nice block I love using it um as well as the packed mud brick um but it is a bit of a pain to texture um and i added a little chimney there so sort of going like yeah somebody might live in there so we'll give them a chimney um got some windows um just simple trap doors and stuff uh added a portcullis or a gate or some sort of uh, thing in the gate you know sort of helps to defend the place um yeah it it was really getting into the 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 latter stages of the build now where not much sort of grander stuff is happening it's just the little details um you know uh so we zoom out for the path just just a simple path really um but yeah uh i suppose while we do that um i can i can give a drop a couple things about the next um the next building with slime pirate video um i haven't said that in a while um but yeah the next video for that series uh should for you be coming out i think hopefully in a week uh if i've got everything correct um there's going to be some big changes um hopefully progress maybe don't know i'll have to get your guys opinion on that because uh you know people have different opinions on progress um but um it should be good um and hopefully if i'm you know if i'm happy with it um, it will end up some good motivation because wow the projects i've got planned are big and uh, i don't like resource collection i'll have to learn redstone um that's gonna be a struggle um but yeah finishing up the build here um i didn't really know what camera to choose so i just chose a wide one um just clearing out some trees adding some bushes bone mealing the surface yeah. and there we go the build is done um hope you enjoyed and uh yeah i'll see you next time enjoy the cinematics